Hi, my name is Kirk Hamilton. I'm a practicing physician assistant of 30 years, nutrition, prevention, and integrative medicine, author, health educator, and host of this show, The Staying Healthy Today Show. Today's show topic is migraine headaches. Let's stop them. Over 30 years, I got to tell you, I like working with migraine headache people because very seldom, I can't even think of one time where nothing positive happened. There's always a reduction in the frequency of migraine headaches if you do some basic, simple things. Now, my mind was triggered to this topic because of this article entitled um, Magnesium Sulfate in the Treatment of Acute Migraine Headaches. So if you get one, sometimes what we do in the clinic is give a couple of grams of intravenous magnesium and if you get it early enough, you can knock it out. But I'd like to give you a simple protocol of how to approach migraine headaches. Number one is you've got to eat whole unprocessed foods but it has to be a low allergy diet. So if you know there's some food triggers, obviously get them out. But I would eat off my basic elimination diet for one month. It'd eliminate some of the classic allergens such as dairy, such as glutinous grains, such as eggs, such as the nightshade family, okay, certain types of citrus. Those foods are classics, especially dairy, glutinous grains, and eggs. And then obviously you're eating whole food diets, so you're trying to cut the caffeine out and you're trying to cut the sugar out. Number two is there's some supplements that help. Magnesium is one of them. Three to 500 milligrams a day, as long as you don't get loose stools or diarrhea, very safe. Coenzyme Q10, 100 to 200 milligrams a day, use the ubiquinol form. Um, riboflavin has been used in high dose. Now, sometimes I use a high dose B complex, B100, but it's at 400 milligrams per day of riboflavin that has been used. Um, and those are some of the basics. There are others, but I'll list. Uh, those in the YouTube description below. I'll have a link to this article and I have a link to my basic elimination diet. You can reduce the incidence of migraine headache. Very rarely have I seen it not happen. I can't remember. It's okay. My name is Kirk Hamilton. Sign up for my health letter and I'll talk to you soon. You have a fabulous day.